This is called the English plantain. This plant is edible to some degree. I will taste a piece for you right now. I don't particularly like the English plantain flavor, but you can chew this up and make a pulpus out of it and use it for bug bites. It does work good for that. This plant is also known as toe knockers because they make these little toe knockers here. And when you walk through a field of these things, that's all you hear is knocking against your shoes and your boots. So they call them toe knockers. But the, the more common name is called the English plantain. I will leave the botanical name and the description and the, the title. And this plant to me is an invasive species. If I were to just pan you around my lawn a little bit, you'll see that this is like maybe 30 to 40 percent of my lawn is this particular plant. It's not registered as an invasive species, but it can be invasive on your property. So you may want to try to control it by letting your grass grow for a year without trying to cut it. And the taller grasses will crowd it out and kill it. That's one way to control it. That's how I control it naturally. Though you can't legally do that in some states and some townships will give you a fine if you don't cut your lawn. So you end up having to cut it, and that just causes it to spread even more. But each one of these buds is basically a seed pod, you know. Here's, here's a close-up look at it. All right. And I'm going to taste this right now for you. It tastes just like the broadleaf plantain. don't care for this one. It's not bad. It's It's okay. I don't particularly care to eat these particular kind of leafy plants. They are known to have oxalic acids in them and other compounds in it that can be not good for your health if you eat enough of them. A leaf here and there is not going to hurt you, but you don't want to make a salad out of that per se. And these plants can get quite big. So a lot of times they're just small little plants and you'll see them all over my yard. But these can get very big. This happens to be a very, very big one. Yeah, I ain't pulling this one up. That's the root system. It's not real deep. It doesn't make a real big taproot. Though it can make a taproot. And it puts all these side roots out. That make it very hard to pull up. But that is your English plantain. That's what the leaf looks like on it. There's a, there's a profile of it looking smaller. Again, you'll see it with these these little buds that come up. Again, they call this toe knockers because when you're walking through your yard, you'll hear nothing but knocking against your shoes. That's these things kicking off your shoes, okay? So that is the English plantain. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you on the next one. Take care.